Hey guys and welcome back. I'm Rachel O'Leary and I've noticed recently in the comments that a lot of you guys have been asking about how my big boys are doing. Now if you're new here, this is my primitive fish aquarium that has three Polypterus and Lacerae or saddle bikers as well as a Cuban gar and a tropical gar. Um, it is a bare bottom aquarium but has large pieces of driftwood that have been colonized with physidens and is planted with a huge piece of African water fern. This aquarium has been running for over a decade now and I've had these fish for about 12 years at this point. Uh, they are an exceptionally long-lived species and in fact they're written into my will uh, to make sure that they are car cared for for their entire lives. I think a lot of people think that large predatory fish require a live food diet and as ambush predators in the wild they certainly would eat fish but in an aquarium I find it best to feed them pellets. I feed them a range of foods. Um, Extreme makes a nice monster pellet. Hikari makes some floating sticks that are good for the gars. I feed them freeze-dried krill as well as occasional frozen shrimp and uh, white fish fillets, and even sometimes earthworms and crickets, though that is more of a treat and a rarity. This is a 240 gallon aquarium. It's two feet from front to back. Eventually I would like to upgrade them into a significantly larger aquarium as these are some big fish, but they're not particularly uh, active except for when they think they're going to be fed, like right now. So really, while it's not perfect, it is, it is suitable for them at this size, in my opinion, and, and with my experience with these fish. This is the aquarium that used to be fully colonized with black beard algae. You can see it's grown back onto the back wall, um, but it has not recolonized the rest of the aquarium. I keep this aquarium bare bottom because these guys are big eaters and their poop looks like Lincoln Logs. This tank is drilled on the bottom and is plumbed to two FX6 filters. It has the Siche circulating pump as well as an AquaClear 110 hang on back in order to uh, maintain the filtration in this aquarium. It gets weekly water changes of about 30% and the fish are fed about twice a week, like sometimes three times a week. Um, with large predatory fish like this, they're not used to eating all the time. So I find that this is the best way to maintain their health. And you can tell from their condition that they are certainly, certainly uh, well fed. Anyway, I just wanted to share with you guys a quick update on this aquarium and these fish. I hope that you've enjoyed it. They bring me a lot of joy. And if you're interested in species spotlights on any of these fish, I do have them and can put them in the cards for you. Um, as always, thank you for the continued support. I hope you're staying safe and I will see you in the next video.